Thank you. And we are back at the happiest place on earth, and it is surreal. There are cameras everywhere. Entry process, super easy. They did not check IDs, although they reserved the right. Did you get mine too? Thank you. I got excited. I left my ticket at the gate for those of you watching along at home. And uh, we're going to start the live stream in just a minute. Um, it will be a blast. But uh, this is the view. How are you feeling, Katie? Here it comes. Katie, you're back at Disneyland. How are you doing? <laughs> we knew it was coming. I was on national radio this morning and I said there will be people that cry in our party. And uh, Jeff, you're going the wrong way. there it is as the train comes back into the station. It is perfect. Welcome back to Disneyland, everybody. It is again the happiest place on earth. And it's beautiful. And we are back at the happiest place on earth. It is one of my favorite places is Main Street. And it's just beautiful to be back and see faces that we haven't seen in a very long time. Thank you. Thanks for joining us in. Hi. Good morning, Roger. If you don't know Jim here on the right, you don't know one of the nicest cast members at Disney. Good morning, Jim. Good to see you. Thank you. Chairman of Parks and Resorts, Josh Diamaro is up here. I need to say hi. Katie, can you maybe take a picture? Hey, Josh, can I get a photo? You can go first. Janet, give us a picture. 
I'm disappointed I'm not wearing the bow tie, but that's oh, okay. Yes. I, it's hard to recognize I you. I should have known this year. Fedora. Good to right? see you. Good to see you. You guys did an awesome job. Yeah, thank you. Beautiful. Welcome back. Yes. Thank you. It's a huge day. It's huge amazing. Day. I'm so happy to have all these cast members back. Us have too. you guys back. Us too. Welcome. Thank Welcome. you guys for all you did. Can Absolutely. I get a picture? Yes. Good thank you guys. It's been a long time. It's been looking great, guys. Thank you. You Welcome guys have back. a great day. Congratulations. Sorry about the bad videography there, but uh, you can't miss those moments. This is impressive. I'm reminded of... How are you guys? Hey, I'm so glad to see you guys. It's so good seeing you. It's I nice to see you too, beyond the screen. <laughs> I know, right? It's good to be I know. I had to uh, downgrade from the tie. It was too hot this morning. I don't blame like, you. Yeah. I'm going to die these if I These things are rolling that. up here in a little bit. So. Well, yeah, that doesn't look so good. <laughs> yeah. But you guys at least look really good. Well, like, thank you. Thank yeah. you. How you been? Busy, but good. Good. Okay. good. I can't complain. Busy is good. Right? So. And, and this is fantastic. It's amazing. Yeah. It's this crazy. is everything you'd hope it would be. Yep. And I love the symmetry in my head of we had this as we were exiting DCA a year ago. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And now it's it's back and it's it's beautiful. It's Can I get a picture of you guys? Of course. Of course. I love your mask. It looks amazing. Thank you. I had a friend make it. Oh, really? Yeah. It looks very nice. It's a lot easier to smile this way, I guess. I know, huh? right? <laughs> well, you true. guys have a fantastic day. You as well. Good to see you, good to see you guys. See you soon, hopefully. Thank you. I hope so too. Good morning. Good morning. Have a great day today. Good morning, Thank you. Guys. Welcome back. Good morning. Welcome. Thank you. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome back. Thank you. Good morning. Welcome. Thank you. Have fun today. Thank you. So once you get off Main Street, it opens up quite a bit, and uh, that's a wonderful thing. You can see the people streaming down Main Street. in the moment. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome home. Esteban. Thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> Should we go see the castle? Yes. Are you ready for this? I mean, it's right there, but... You know. <laughs> There is a line to get your picture taken in front of the castle that apparently starts right there. So we'll go up here and take the uh, scenic route. I think we should go that way, huh? 
For those of you that are NPR listeners, you might have heard Daps Magic mentioned this morning in regards to their coverage of the reopening of Disneyland. The one and the only Mr. Daps. That is correct. So many familiar faces as we're walking around. It's yeah. very fun. It's nice to see. Mm -hmm. We should walk through the castle. I'll follow you. they did this. I think the rock work that uh, goes into the castle is beautiful, it's refreshed, um, and most importantly, above the queue, the evil queen is still watching. So. There's the queen. Also newly refurbished. We'll wait for the queen for a minute. There she was. Beautiful morning. I don't know about you, but once the stream is over, I'm all about the coffee. <laughs> you know what? I have cold brew. So I'm not. I feel like you should get a picture of me in this. Okay. Let's do the Disney experience. Oh wait, let's make it funny. <laughs> Did you get one? Yeah, I got a few. Okay. wearing a jacket this morning too and it didn't make it even to like our line I think we were done. Um, 
You know what I think we should do? What should we do? Let's go see that really big building that's not actually there. Yeah. Wait, is that open? I know. So normally Toontown opens. It's true. After the park. <laughs> Fun fact. I got excited, you know. Well, it would be nice if Toontown was open. Yes, it would be. But, I, you know, we'll see. Technically the park isn't even supposed to be open, right? Yeah, we're here before technically it opened. I'm curious if there'll be an announcement. I know. I'm thinking we'll circle back just in case. So let's do a loop through Tomorrowland, show that off. Yeah, I like Tomorrowland. Um, and actually we'll see the small world first because it's gorgeous. Then on the off chance that there is an announcement, we'll have caught it. Yeah. I don't think there will be, but you never know. We will be back for this later. Beautiful. Friend Angela's here. Angela! Hope you're okay with being on camera today. <laughs> say, everyone say good morning, Angela. Good morning, good morning. Angela. Oh my gosh. I can follow directions. Yeah, you, <laughs> you made it in really fast. I was, I was a little worried. I was like, it looks pretty crazy. All right, we're gonna walk through Tomorrowland. We're just doing a tour. So technically, yeah, I'll be curious to see, like, are they counting this as the official open at 9 o'clock, or is it at 8 o'clock? I don't know. <laughs> but you can see how quiet it is back here. To me, a lot like um, opening day of Rise of the Resistance, where the park didn't open until 9 a.m. Good morning, thank you. But we were able to get in at... Uh, yes, Splash Mountain will be in operation today. Again, probably not cycling through the attraction quite yet because it's not 9 a.m. So. But it looks like some Fantasyland attractions are taking guests. Uh, next, we're gonna head through Tomorrowland. Go see what's happening over there. So we can see Space Mickey. That's my priority today. And by the way, while yes. we have you all here, while we have you if all you here. do want to book a Disney trip in the upcoming days, weeks, months, now that it's all open, uh, we now have a partner in Mouseways Travels that uh, when you book through them, you actually save money. There's no charge, but uh, we get like a referral fee or something. So it actually helps support all of this kind of stuff, buying batteries and cameras. and Because we did buy batteries last night. <laughs> well, that and... and as the site gets bigger, it gets more expensive. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, running a website, so, it's a trap. If you want to book your next trip and support DAPS at the same time, go to mouseways.com slash DAPS magic, and then you'll be helping yourself save money, but you'll also be helping DAPS magic, and we will be eternally thankful. And we love you. We already do. Well, yeah, but I'm just <laughs> reminding you that we love a, you. That was pretty good. Like, I didn't even think of that. Well done, Mr. Daps. I'm not used to this No thing. teleprompter or anything. I need the teleprompter. No, you need bullet points. Bullet points are good. You want to see what I love? It's now in family run and boutique. And boutique. So true. you know that you're getting a personalized experience that's not just off the rack. It's just for you. And, and Matthew's amazing. So he is. You can't go wrong. 
and he answers it just about any time of day. Bless that man. <laughs> Bailey said, good ad read, Mr. Knapp. Thanks. <laughs> Minus the reading. <laughs> good ad thought. <clears throat> Look at how empty it is here, guys. We just have to take a moment to appreciate this. That there's nobody at Galactic Grill? Well, that Tomorrowland is virtually empty. Like, I'm sure the stores or something will be busy, but... I can honestly tell you, other than... No R2D2 at... new emotes. <laughs> well, and other than press events, so I can't remember being in a more empty Tomorrowland. True. Like, the last time I remember it being this empty, it was a little bit emptier, I guess, was the Star Tours reopening day. They woke up. Maybe somebody threw a piece of bread. <laughs> Tomorrowland is rather quiet, though. It is. Um, I find really that the only truly crowded places are like Main Street USA, train station, castle, um, and then once it disperses into the park, there's really not a whole lot of crowd. We'll keep you updated on this throughout the day, definitely. Um, also, now, take the time, follow us on Twitter, follow at Mr. Daps, also follow at Daps underscore magic, um, we will be live tweeting our day, so, I would say follow me, but my name's hard to spell, so that's fine. <laughs> if you know that's how to spell my name, that's great. That's fine. You win. Yeah, I just don't expect that most people what do. What do you do I'd like to imagine a new emo Chewbacca, Bailey. That would make me happy. I'd like to put him in a cute little outfit. <laughs> and then a new emo C3PO to go with the new emo Chewbacca. Look at the new artwork, too. <laughs> See the new artwork? I was like, look at this modern art. I love it. Also something important to know, all cues are very empty. pretty. So Space Mountain, which is normally partially is It's funny because as I'm walking through Tomorrowland, there's a definite smell that is hitting me nostalgically, and I love it. And then you went, and you were like, I'm not going on the water slide, and you did, and it was amazing. We are officially in an open Disneyland and Disney California adventure, I guess. Uh, we showed up in the security line at about 7 and Disney started letting him get early, so that is how we got into Florida. A little bit of magic, a lot of luck, I guess. Also important to know, we did not park at Nick's office. So. But Angela did. But Angela and she did. got in and she got just in a few minutes after us. After us. In fact, she left as we were walking over. So Mickey and Friends is a very quick way to get into the park, yes, it seemed yeah. like. Yeah, so that's like 10 minutes, 15 minutes after us, maybe. And you didn't have to wait out in the tram. In the sun. Tram that's no line for the parking structure. Walk straight through the, the security, no lines at all. That's fantastic. Except the one uh, to get in here. It stopped for a while, and then it moved, and we walked through. 
Love it. Well done, Disney. Very, very kind of you. We will absolutely enjoy our day. Um, thank you for spelling my name right. That means a lot to me. <laughs> <laughs> it does. It really does. Um, Mr. Daps will normally hear about it when someone spells my name correctly because it makes me so happy. Yeah. So. So I think we should just keep looping around. Yeah, I think that we should. Doing some head weird. Over to Adventureland. Sure. We're doing a little crisscross. Motion. Maybe walk through the hub a little bit and see. This cross will make you jump, jump. Well, and see the renovated partner statue. The partner statue looks beautiful. It looks, oh, it looks better than I've ever seen it. Yeah. I mean, listen, I wasn't alive when it was installed, but I imagine it looks even better than it did. And we'll try to stay out of people's way and all that fun jazz. Yeah, let's not. If you folks are interested in the photo, we have a little line right here. Yeah. It looked like they were all transitioning, so I think we're okay. A Where's Waldo of Mr. Daphne right. ending up in people. Are they there? Look for us and then tag us Look in other us. people's We're pictures. <laughs> um, very spring colors. What are you wearing on this illustrious occasion, Katie? Is that what they do at the Oscars? We only do the Dapsies, <laughs> so I don't know. Who are you wearing? I'm sorry. I actually have a funny story about the dress that I am wearing. I apologize for those of you watching this because that might have been really loud. Uh, no, you're on the other side of the microphone. Fine. No, I'm at this one. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Um, so I bought this dress the week Disneyland closed. That is true. And I said, if Disneyland really opens, I can wear this lovely, beautiful dress. Um, 14 months later, I finally get to wear it to Disneyland. So, minor technicality. Better late than never. Better late than never. It doesn't feel good. It does. Honestly, it, it almost feels a little bit more magical. Yeah, you had to wait so for long. it. Totally. Yeah, I bought this in March of 2020. That's why I did it for years. <laughs> <laughs> I, when I was thinking about what I should wear today, I was like, well, this feels like an obvious choice. <laughs> You're way ahead of all of us. You planned your outfit. <laughs> <laughs> right? Oh, man. <laughs> New good. record. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you. Thank you. So happy you guys are back. Thank you. So happy you are back. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Again, I said we getting this to another place again now. So it's just a little magic It's just a happy day for them. In some ways bigger. So. Like this is this is a bigger day for a lot of them. No line for Bengal barbecue. Hey oh. That's a win. Indiana Jones has a line. Oh, Are we yeah, shocked? But again, that's the ride that makes this kind of north Yeah, and you're waiting all outside, you're then you're walking all the way through. Outside. Yeah, you're. You just get to walk through the um, again, one of those attractions where your brain is rewired. Where you go, oh, I'm, I'm heading inside, trying to start the wait. And boom, you're on the attraction. Very nice. Higher is the most You don't realize how many indoor there are. Yep. If you're counting, you win. I feel like I'm already at 20. And there's the Mark Twain. The Mark Twain as well as Look at her go. That's pretty hard to beat. Jack is open. We love the Mark Twain. I am going to make an assumption. I don't know anything for sure, but there's normally a magical moment um, where guests can be 
Yeah, that doesn't seem uh, very <laughs> physically distant. No, uh, it's a very tight space. So I'm gonna guess that magic moment did not exist, but it will make the magic even better. Even more magical? Yeah, okay, also how many times can I say magical? Also, hello, Taylor. I am so happy to see that you're watching. Um, hey, Taylor. Had to know we'd be live streaming. <laughs> but thank you for being a part of this and helping. And if you're magic. enjoying it, share it with other people too. What attractions are those? Oh, hey, hey how are you guys? Good, Good to see you. We got here at seven okay. and something. Oh, okay. Okay. And then we were in by like eight. Oh, eight, nice. 15, okay, like not bad at all. Yeah, we got in like five, so it wasn't too bad. Nice. Yeah, it was good. That's nice. super early. Good to see I you. I like your mask. Thank you. I had a friend make it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. you guys have fun. Bye. Good to see you. And that's what makes Disney magical is seeing all of your friends from everywhere. Yes, I can help you out. Uh, Jungle Cruise, Matterhorn, uh, all of the shows, all of the shows. Yeah. So like no, Abe Lincoln, all that kind of fun yeah. stuff. Um, all of Toontown seems open. Yeah. Except for making the <laughs> Well, that's not. Okay. Ba boom. Full article on BassMagic.com that has. The attractions for Disneyland Park and Disney California Adventure Park that are yeah. open and closed. Yeah. And um, you can check that out. Because, like I said, even though I wrote the article, I don't remember. Well, and the fun part is with this is a lot of them are open. Like, it's true. It's, like, it's a surprising open. amount of attractions. Tom Sawyer Island's not open right now. Yes. Um, I mean, that would be really hard to physical distance on those rafts. There's a lot of, also a lot of tight spaces in the pirate player. Yeah. Yeah, so that makes sense, but most of the, like... And a lot of the attractions that are closed are planning to reopen this summer, simply because of the purpose. Yeah. It's... Also important to know, our lovely, dear, haunted mansion has reopened. And we do have a video up of it, if you'd like to check it out. We do have a video from this week, so it'll be updated. Uh, but it has, this version of the attraction has not existed since, uh... 2019, I believe, because it was holiday. Yeah. We went down for a tourist right? And it's been gone. So. Yeah, definitely things are changing on a daily basis. Um, <laughs> well, even capacity has changed yeah. this week. Like, uh, originally it was going to be 15%, and then it was 25%. And I would expect it to go up even more. Hello, my friend! We're back! We are back! I am so happy to see you. Hi, likewise, my friend. We are, it's dueling live streams. It's like, <laughs> we've got, hey, pitch yourself. Uh, we are Beautiful Tomorrow TV here for the grand reopening of Disneyland right here with Mr. Dapp's Magic. It is a beautiful day here. It's gonna be hot. That's okay. Yeah. That's why I don't have a bow tie this this time. Otherwise, no bow tie. I know I had to <laughs> I had to survive. Same. I didn't Water, even wear the button the, down, dude. Yeah, you were probably smarter than me, <laughs> but uh, it is a beautiful morning here awesome. and uh, Enjoy your day. You too, We're gonna man. bump into each other a million yes, times. I know but <laughs> good to see you likewise. Man. Good to be back. Good stuff. Love the channel. Good to Everything. see you. Yeah. Thank you so much <laughs> Great guy one of the nicest guys you'll find on the internet and uh, I'm almost wondering if we should go up to here and then loop around through Frontierland and then head into Galaxy's Edge I know what I know actually you know what let's do it this way Okay. I like this, this entrance. Way. This is a better build for Galaxy's Edge. We want to give the theatrical cinematic experience. Could we do a week through Critter Country and then hit? Yeah, we could do that. You know what? Why not? That's wise. I hear the Splash Mountain open. I hear people. I'm looking forward to seeing what they do with it. I am so excited. I feel like there's so many possibilities. Yeah. Even 
though the reseam is planned, there is a planned refurbishment. The attraction is open. Um, no word yet on when they're going to uh, close it, I believe. Yeah. And hear it. Uh, like hearing it is very nice too. Mr. Daps, what battery pack are you using for your GoPro? Um, just the one that came with it, and then I've got an external battery that I can plug into this when the battery gets low. Which I should check because I've been recording this whole thing. We're still at like 50%. We're good. We've got the good technology here. That's yeah. Magic. Um, yes, today is brought to you by portable chargers. <laughs> Not mouse waste travel. <laughs> I have two in my purse. Oh, uh, and I know Mr. Daps has one. So we are going to finish this live stream in the next probably 45 minutes because we have an hour from whenever our rise uh, thing hits, boarding group hits, and then we will go on a galactic adventure. So I'm going to brag on Angela for a bit because yeah. she's incredible. Um, let's, let's, yeah, I thought, let's gush on a Angela for I a few minutes. I was really fast. <laughs> like crying today. We, we I, thought we were fast, I but no, we both did. All the pro tips you can follow for, like I turned off my Wi-Fi. I refreshed it seven minutes and one second. Like I did all of those things. And I'm like, wow, I was fast. What could my boarding group be? And then I see you're already in a virtual queue. And I go, get out. And I know it's on this map because he's over here struggling. I was actually ahead of you, though. Anyway, he, because I, <laughs> I hear him yell, something went wrong. So I know it wasn't him. I think it's because I was so close to her. It hadn't even said that we had. The system was like, whoa. It was just like, on. you can't do anything. So Angela is incredible. Yeah, I love her. Thank you. So I did. we're boarding group 23? Yeah. Yeah, okay, she's wild. So anyway, we love on floor. Thank you to for making it today possible. They changed the virtual key system. So it's additive now. If you have multiple people in your party, you yeah. select who you want to go. Yeah. You don't have to remove who you don't want to go. Yeah. Yep. That's what always delayed me before. But now they, you guys are all pre-selected. Yeah. Oh. So it was like join, done, boom. Well and, and it go. It looked like it recognized who was yes. had reservations yes. for the day too, it so did. they were the only ones that were available, yes. and that was good too because we have multiple tickets, yes. so that yes. could have been a headache. So yes. anyway, we're on Angela because Thank we are boarding group 23. Yeah. And I think that's pretty darn So let's go wander through Galaxy's Edge. Yeah. And we need to hit Frontierland still. Yeah. And uh, we'll make it a great adventure. And then maybe we'll end in Fantasyland, because that seems that appropriate. Seems cool. Also, good morning, Steven. Good morning, I'm Steven. So happy to see you. Um, I hope you saw the coverage of the horses that were on Main Street. I I am very sorry I did not catch which horse it was. Maybe he can tell us. He knows it by sight. That's true. I know he uh, I know the horse was dark brown, had white marking. Hold on. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> See ya. Also, good morning, Victoria. Good morning. Very happy to see you. I had to get a picture with Tony. I know. I was just making sure that you knew. We always, we always don't do a great job of documenting ourselves during the day. <laughs> so like today I'm like, we're taking pictures of us with things and people now instead of what's just in front of us. Oh, also important to note on things that are closed. Refreshment Corner, formerly known as Cook Corner, is Hungry closed. Bear. Hungry Bear. Hungry Bear. I'm surprised about that. Me too, because it's got lots um, of space. Yeah. So, if it's like you your like a primary outdoor, outdoor dining. I don't know. Right. The place to get one is the kiosk that is across from Big Thunder Mountain Entrance. Look at this view. Um, Maximus is famous. Based on who I described. I hope I'm correct. <laughs> Me too. But Maximus is a new horse. 
Wow, a new horse and you're, you're working the reopening. New horse, Disneyland. new era at Disneyland. Wow, that's beautiful. <laughs> also, Taylor, it is making my heart just as happy to see that we have friends that we get to share this with. Like, that sounds really cheesy. But that's what it's, it's about. It's true. Yeah. Like, half the fun that's, of that's like, 100 really live streams is getting to see people in the chat getting to see whatever it is they want to see actually a fun thing um if you're watching and you feel comfortable participating let us know where you're watching from um because it's fun to see where we get to reach and who's watching our silly streams from Disneyland. so also important to note hand sanitizer exists in space well i guess we're not in space yet but it also exists in space keep getting text messages from people that are like, I just heard you on NPR. That is so fun. That is bizarre. Like, that's not something I ever thought I would say. Hi, it's Greg on my friend's day. Mr. Dapps is one of the coolest people I've ever met in my whole life. I'm embarrassing him. But seriously, like, that's my best friend. He's the coolest. He's embarrassed for himself now. Um, <laughs> It is weird to think a year ago, was it a year ago? Yeah, a year ago, we were crammed in here with thousands of other people. <laughs> a year and a half for ride. Waiting to get into, yeah. And then a year and a half, two years two ago? Two years ago. We were also crammed here, waiting to actually get into the land. It's really, really crazy. Good morning. Out. Bright suns. <laughs> Bright suns. Really? You know, I'm really happy to see the citizens of Batu. I hope they feel the same way about it. Uh, it is beautiful. <laughs> I don't know. Bright signs. Bright, Bright signs. <laughs> my outpost, my inner glass wall. Welcome. Who's the furthest away? So far, it's Ryan. Okay, Ryan, you're winning. I say Mexico's a little bit farther than Scottsdale, Arizona. This might be the emptiest you'll see Galaxy's Edge. That's very true. Ever. It's generally not this quiet. But wow, it's so nice to see. It really is. we can like cut kind of through the stores i know they have the virtual or the queue yeah but we can at least give a little bit of a view of that and then cut down the stairs <clears throat> Today. We'll see. We try not to crash the Millennium Falcon because that's very sad. 
<laughs> Should we go up the ramp, maybe? Or I guess we can loop over there. just found the video last night. Instructions, I mean. Yeah. He's like, oh yeah. There is no bow tie. We're in when heat it's, index. When it's 90 degrees and humid, which it is, and uh, we haven't done this in over a year, it didn't seem like my wisest choice to wear a bow tie. Yes, we are in heat index apps. Um, yes. Because it's 9.23 in the morning and it's 75 degrees. When it was 84, it was like, uh, oh, maybe. But then when it said it was going to be 90, and it always feels warmer at Disneyland, I was like, okay, this may not happen. It always feels warmer at Disneyland. That's the title of my book. And normally I just push through. But we want to survive too. Yes, and we want it to be fun. Bright signs, folks. Welcome back. Bright signs. Thank you. Yes. Powered by her universe. Yes. Um, it's one of the first ones that they gave me. So it's got. I get closer. Okay. It's got some Star Wars stuff on. Star Wars. We're gonna have to come back here and take pictures later. I think. I just like how caring they are towards everybody. Like they really do try to build everybody up and they're positive and yeah. they're inclusive. And and so um, there's other brands out there that are awesome also, but aren't as forward about their agenda of kindness. And I like that they're very like, hey, we want to be nice to people and we want people to feel good about themselves. And we want them to know that they, they're important and they're valued. Um, one of my favorite things about her universe um, is they are very big on the health. Yeah. Um, Look at how empty this is. It's very accurate. They found him at D23 and said, would you like to do something there? And they're amazing. Yes. So, love them. <clears throat> and that would be at heruniverse.com. <laughs> Look at him. Look I can do website URLs. <laughs> I'm so proud I'm, of I'm you. very generous today. I want to support Matthew. I want to support Ashley. They're all good people. Yes, I agree. Tony, we need to. Tony. Yeah. Murray on the other screen. We want to support him. Yeah. Gong. Gong. I 
if there was a Oh! Oh! We are on, we have It's time. We are timed. So we are going to go through Frontierland and then uh, head to our adventure. Uh, I would just like to say this uh, Please do. Hey everybody! This is uh, Sarah's Angela. I look like the Invisible Man. We're kicking it! It's fun! <laughs> anyway, back to the things you want to see. Like Frontierland. I love uh, these entrances to the land though. This was the first entrance we ever came through. This is so true. The first time we came to Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. Yeah. So it always kind of holds a special place in my heart thinking of like standing here. I believe that was the day I actually met Josh Diamaro too. Is that correct? No. Oh, no. I'm thinking of a different day. No, because that was the, the bow tie of, day. You're thinking of the actual first day. Yes. Did we also come through this entrance on the actual first day? Yeah, we waited right here. And then we went through that. You know what? It was Sometimes amazing. all of your uh, days start to blend together. Designated dining area. Designated Which, dining area. They're just about everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> Almost everywhere you can sit is a designated dining area. Which is good because then it's within state compliance and we can still eat. Yeah. So I'm we thinking, uh, should we hang to the right? Sure. Uh, very exciting to see that Rise of the Resistance is already up and at them. Yeah, it's working really well today. Don't say that. It's not working at all today. The force is not strong with it at all. Oh no, what a bummer. I've always liked this area. It's just so serene. We did not see Bob Iger when we walked in, but we did see Josh Dean. We didn't see Bob Chapek either. I'm betting they were doing interviews somewhere on like yes. a roof or something. Yeah, we did not see either Bob. We did see Josh. The Bobs. We also didn't see Ken. We might have and just not realized it. That's potential. Like, also, it's hard with the masks to recognize people. I mean, we might have seen Bob Chapek and Bob Iger too and just not. Um, realized. That's making me very Seems like such a lifetime ago. <laughs> Isn't this amazing? It is. It's oh wonderful. Gosh, yeah. How are you? I'm good. Are you guys, guys really having fun? Oh you clearly oh made it gosh, through amazing. the crazy of the last year and absolutely, a half or whatever. Absolutely bawling when I came. Oh, that's yeah. perfect though. Yeah. That's the best day ever. And yeah. all the cast members waving. Oh, and oh my gosh. Gosh. Beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. We actually ran into Josh Tamaro. Yes. Last night. Yep. Such yeah, a good guy. So fun. And Ken Contra, hot rug. Yeah. How do you say his name? And then one more. They were we were oh, looking yeah. inside the gate last night after everybody pretty much had gone. It was at 9:30. Uh huh. We saw some people back on Main Street. We're like, oh, I wonder what they're doing. Okay. Right. And all of a sudden they started walking towards us, and it was them. Oh, that's and cool. Then Get Seth ready Gal for the big day. Had she was videoing us it's and asking us questions. questions. Nice. I have no idea who she was. Blonde gal. We'll see if they pop I up. It, huh? I know. <laughs> so on what's camera. what's your big thing you want to do today? Thunder. Thunder. <laughs> do it then. Thunder. Let's just rise of the resistance. We're, we're that's our next nine. thing. Yeah. We're 23. Good to, Good to see you guys. Good to see you. Have fun. Thank you. You too. Thanks. Candlelight's one of our favorite things to do each year and uh, it's always fun the people that we meet and friendships we make as we're waiting for hours and hours and hours to watch the original Christmas story. And uh, yeah, we've met so many people through the years that absolutely amazing. Same with College Band, which we will definitely be missing this year. And, um, but you know what? Maybe next year. That would be very magical. Who are you hoping to see today? Miguel. Yeah. He's here and he's also over there. So, 
the same time. Whoa. Magic. <laughs> so I'm really hoping we get to see Miguel. I think that'd be a whole lot of fun. Um, and this we've only got to see him in Magic Carpet. So, yeah. So some magic will be happening in Frontierland. Magic will be happening. <laughs> And we're going to go by Snow White's Grotto because we had a request to see that, I remember. Oh, I think that's wonderful. Yes, Conchito was also there um, earlier this week, I think. I saw some pictures of Conchito. Yeah. Um, whoever we get to see, I promise you, we'll be taking photos because... And video. To me... Uh, getting to see characters is one of the most magical things that you could do at Disneyland. This so, is true. The magic comes from the characters. Like that ad that's running, magic is here. And the cast members. Yes. Oh, Hello. Hello. I think my favorite thing is, is this person waving and saying hello to me because they know me. Oh yeah, 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 this way. I think a lot of Sometimes confused. <laughs> this might be. I know. I know there are lots of people taking their photo. It's still a lot less crowded than most days. Ooh. And the line for Snow White has definitely uh, extended quite a bit this morning. Uh, the area that is normally used to queue for the Princess Fantasy Fair is being used as a queue for Snow White's Enchanted Wish. In fact, it looks like most of Fantasy Fair is being used for the queue currently. Because, obviously, the Royal Fantasy Fair is not open. That's okay. okay. We have now circled all of Disneyland. Oh wait, we need to go to Toontown real quick. I need to remind them. We need to go to one more place. 
we're going to one more place. Really fast. We need to walk back to Toontown and see the big building that's not there. And okay. then we're gonna go on Rise to Resistance. Exactly. seems to be the busiest area of the park today. I'm sure a big part of that has to do with the reopening of Snow White's Enchanted Wish, which is completely enchanting. It's a beautiful attraction. They've done a fantastic job with it. Added story elements that really make the attraction more complete as opposed to just some like bullet points from the story that don't always make sense. And uh, I think it proved again that uh, Imagineering really does a good job. And, and uh, I'm consistently impressed by Kim Irvine and what she's done in the parks over the years. And uh, from other Fantasyland attractions to Main Street shops and stores, uh, they just do a really nice job of enhancing places while also staying true to the uh, foundation of what they were and, and continue to be. And as one would expect on a day like today, you do see uh, photographers and videographers and reporters just like us throughout the park getting videos that I assume will be filed for stories going up around the globe today, which is also rather amazing. We've got Tigger and Eeyore. Oh, and Winnie the Pooh. Yep. The new Hundred Acre Wood. Twenty Twenty One. Yeah. on your face because we're wearing masks. That is exactly what Penelope said. You're going to get really weird. Uh... <laughs> Toontown is open. Toontown Good news. is open. Small World Wall is available if you want to close and open it. Come in. It's just these the things I didn't even realize how much I missed. If you look very closely up there, you can see Paul and Calvin from Window to the Magic. Another, another awesome podcast that we need to shout out. It's so fun to get to see friends. Fun with friends. They might be streaming too, for all we know. Uh, or at very least recording. They're probably doing an audio recording. They have some of the, well, they are the best. 
at getting binaural sound from the parks and creating that magical experience that you can relive as you close your eyes and listen to them walk through the parks. Um, talking about opening day of Galaxy's Edge, we were with them on opening day of Galaxy's Edge. Um, it was a whole lot of fun. So what big building? There's no big building here. So here's my personal <laughs> I love it. I knew it was a big building. It's big. I didn't realize, but I didn't realize how big the building was. It's big. Um, makes me very excited to see the facade that's going to be here. Um, like I know they're going to get through the Very excited to see how it fits into the style of the We'll come over here and see Roger Rabbit cartoon sprint for our good friend Roger. Because that seems appropriate. As you can see, Toontown is not busy at all. But most of the park is not insanely busy, and that's pretty cool. In the distance I see Mickey hanging out in front of his house which is a lot of fun to see it has been far too long <clears throat> checking his mail looks like look at the big wall and we'll go see Mickey Mouse That's really quite impressive. Robert! Hey, how are you? I recognize that hat anywhere. <laughs> how are you doing, hon? Wonderful. Yay! We're back. We're back. You having fun? Uh, yes. Good. You can't go wrong with that. Okay. <laughs> I think with that, I'm going to end this video and uh, we'll continue on through our day.